So there's these these two windmills. They're on a windmill farm. First windmill turns to the second windmill and says, "Hey, what's your favorite type of music?" Second windmill looks at the first one and says, "I'm a big metal fan." Morning. Cheers. I Cheers. Love, you. love you. Good morning, everyone. Hello. Is anybody out there? <laughs> Bear, no rocks. Nay. Hey, come here. She just spit Get over here. Get over here. <laughs> Too bad you guys can't see her. Goofy it's girl. Funny. <laughs> You're so silly. Our friends that have uh, hung out with us and Bear know how she does it. It's too funny. Yeah, you lay there on your grass. <laughs> well, good morning, everybody. How are you all? We hope that you are doing good. Thank you for being here today with us. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do. And please remember to ding the little bell so that <laughs> you get notified every time we put out a new video. Please remember to give us a thumbs up, comment, and share with your friends you want to torment. Do I need to say anything or should I go? And, and they, they called, called it puppy love. Your voice is too deep. <laughs> and they called it puppy love. <laughs> oh, yes, Lori went to go see Donny Osmond for her birthday with her daughter, and all Tom got was this t-shirt. And this is what I end up with, and she goes, you're wearing it. <laughs> This will be the one and only time, I'm well, sure. It'll be for me. She ordered it. I guess that shows you who wears the pants in this family, because I'm wearing the shirt. <laughs> oh, ha, 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 and ha. I may not be wearing pants. <laughs> nice ones, too. Yeah. Oh, yeah, look at this mess. <laughs> oh, well, first thing, we want to wish... My son, RJ, a RJ. very happy birthday. RJ! It's t coming up Tuesday the 22nd, so happy birthday, RJ. We love yes, you. Yes, we do. Um, last Saturday, I had to get ready for my big date on Sunday with my daughter for my birthday, so I colored my hair, got rid of all the gray, did my nails, did my toes, <laughs> and we watched baseball. There's really nothing... <sighs> <clears throat> and, what? I was excited. And then you went out. And then I went out, yeah. So there was no baseball on Sunday, which was weird. So you had a fun time. I had a Because you didn't really know exactly what was happening. No. Um, she filled me in on all the details prior. So I oh. knew all the stops leading up to this. <laughs> so <laughs> we first thing we did, she had an appointment, and we went and got these bracelets. They call them... Um, permanent bracelets. It's just this cute little chain. It's got little, it, these are all little hearts and they weld it on to you. They just do this little zap. And that was the name of the business too, was zapped. We went in there into the jewelry store and Jolene says, we're here to get zapped. So <laughs> that's what they call it. So they put one little link in here that they zap closed. And if you have to have an MRI or something like that, where you can't have metal on you, um, they'll just cut it, you know, kind of like they would cut off a ring that you couldn't get off. And then you just go back to the jewelry store and they just zap it back together again. So they're so fun. It was awesome. And then we went to dinner and then we got to um, the Silver Legacy is where he was performing. And we got there early. We sit down in the lounge, figured we'll just have a glass of wine before the show. Nothing, nothing. Nobody came to wait on us. Nobody even looked at us. It was like, fine. We saw a Starbucks, we went over there and had coffee instead. <laughs> <laughs> so we got to visit, it was wonderful, and the show was amazing. He puts on an amazing show, so I absolutely loved it. We had so much fun, but the best part of the whole evening was getting to spend time with my daughter. So it's very rare for us to get to spend any amount of time alone together. That was a long time, you guys, and you just had a blast. I did. I did. We had a wonderful time. Yeah. So. You deserved it after playing nurse for so many weeks. <laughs> Not just you, but everyone else, too. <laughs> um, so it was wonderful. And then today, 
we're heading back over there to really to celebrate my birthday with everybody out with the family. Because yesterday was your birthday. Yesterday was my oh, birthday. Oh, God, happy birthday. Yeah, thank you. You'll hear about our day yesterday <laughs> towards the end of this video. Yeah, you'll hear about that. So, so that was a wonderful time. Thank you again, Jolene and Scott, for the wonderful birthday. It was a combination Mother's Day birthday present. Yeah. So, that was incredible. Yep. Yeah. We had amazing seats, too. Second row. They were right, right there right. next to the stage center, almost. Center section, second row back. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. And the show he put on? It's freaking amazing. You know? It's amazing. It's And it's like just a little snippet of his Las Vegas show. So I told Tom, I said, if we are in Vegas... You know, when he is there, when he's doing his residency, we really need to go. We need to just splurge and go see the whole full show. Because how long did he play? Ninety minutes. It was supposed to only be ninety minutes, and he actually played for two hours because he kind of extended this part of this show where he goes, asks the audience for songs that they want him, like for requests. And so he did that for a good long time, and he says, "Okay, this has got to be enough. We could do this." the whole show <laughs> but you don't want that because the whole show is amazing it's got dancers and changes in costumes and I think one of my favorite things my favorite favorite was his tribute to Andy Williams because even as a little girl I had a crush on Andy Williams thought he was so cute um so cute <laughs> I'm sure that's how Andy Williams wanted to be referred to as so cute um <laughs> But Donnie does this eight and a half minute rap about his entire career with photo, with a video and photos He's, and the, sound from, bites. She, they actually videoed it, and I saw it. And he actually raps, choreographed the rap to the video that goes on behind him. And the video had audio parts to it that fit fitted into his rap, and it was it was incredible to watch it. It's really really cool. So he's quite the entertainer, yeah. and uh, we had a wonderful time. I think Jolene really enjoyed her time, too. <laughs> Donnie! <laughs> One bad apple don't spoil the whole bunch, girl. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, so that was fun. Monday, I, st I was working on some cards. We've got a lot of <clears throat> events coming up, birthdays, anniversaries, all that. And you had P.T., at home yep. again. I'm doing PT at home for most He's of the been week. Very, very good about that. I'm very proud of him. Yeah. He's been diligent about doing his physical therapy. Uh, thankfully, um, Kevin and Wendy have um, a, like a gym room with mm -hmm. some equipment you can do, and they have stairs, so two flights of stairs that he can go up, <laughs> up, and go up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down the stairs yep. <clears throat> about 20 different times. And, uh, and I use the, I don't know what you call the ball, yeah, the, the big great big ball, but I use that and... Then one of those sliding discs that you... A sliding slide. disc and the and pedal a, pusher. It's like an elliptical that you sit down in a chair and pedal do not... Pusher. I the, said that. A pedal pusher. <laughs> <laughs> those are, you know, those are little short pants. Well, hello, well, Molly. Molly. Hi, Molly. Hi, baby. Come here. This is this is our niece Malie. Look at this. <laughs> what you doing? She is so sweet. Bear's cousin. Hi, baby. You gonna be on the show today? Huh? Are you gonna be on the show today? She is the best little dog. I mean, you know, little little dog. She's a good little dog. <laughs> we have the best dog, but she's a good little dog. Um, so uh, we watch baseball and, and then. Tuesday. Tuesday was another birthday. It was another birthday. Mm. My baby sister Wendy's birthday. Mommy. Mommy. Come here. Mommy's She's looking fine. for you. She's, She's fine. fine. So my baby sister. So back in the day when, you know, way back, as old as us, <laughs> a mommy had to stay in the hospital for three days after they had their baby. You know, nowadays they shove you out the same day, basically. <laughs> You shove out the kid, they shove you out of the hospital. So anyway, so Wendy came home on my birthday. So ever since, I was seven years old, and ever since then, Wendy's been my birthday present. So best birthday present ever. And then Kaylee is the second birthday present, best birthday yeah. present ever. Yeah. So. Um, and what about this gift? You weren't on my birthday. Uh, but I'm the gift that keeps on giving. Yes, yes. <laughs> 
So you're, yes. Love you're, the Donnie shirt. <laughs> Wendy likes the Donnie shirt. She hadn't seen it yet. <laughs> so uh, Wendy, Wendy had her birthday. She was busy, like we always are on birthdays. But she got to go to lunch with, uh, with Mom and um, Ash, so she had a good day. And then uh, Wednesday I got some chores done, groceries and laundry and all that fun stuff. And then Thursday, I couldn't remember what we did. I forgot to write it down right away. So we saw this little saying and we thought that it was very perfect. How beautiful to do nothing and relax afterwards. And that is RV living full time. Basically, basically. <laughs> Because we do have days where it's like, what did we do today? You think about it. We just putter around, do this, do that, and then the day's gone and you're like, I need to relax. I need to relax. This is exhausting doing nothing. <laughs> so that's so, what we did so Thursday. Actually, Thursday I had to rest up for Friday. Okay? Friday so was here's quite, Friday. quite the day. My birthday. That's her birthday. Yesterday. Yesterday. So first thing, we took the truck in. To get its her biggest birthday present yeah. ever, a brand, a brand new, new transmission. transmission for the truck. Yeah, so we took the truck in to get its <laughs> transmission transplant. I spare no expense on her. Yeah, uh, Tom had PT <laughs> at the physical therapist. Holy cow! And they put you through the ringer. That was a real PT appointment. They yes. uh, they worked my ass over. I got some <laughs> some more video, so we'll add Not that just to my knee. his other video. <laughs> yep. And then we had a couple other errands to run. We had to drop off a package at UPS store to return from Amazon. Okay, we ordered some damp rid. You know what that is? That's the stuff that you should put in your RV, like in your closets and behind things. It absorbs moisture. <clears throat> Granted, we're in dry areas 99% of the time, and you would be surprised how much water those things acquire. Mm -hmm. So we change them out maybe about every six months or so. So we get the box, it has three of them in it. It's like from Damprid. And this box must have been tossed around quite a bit because one of them, there's a little plastic layer inside the container. One holds the little charcoal pebbles and the other part is the water, where the water goes. The, well, the plastic thing was busted and there were the little charcoal pebbles were all over the place in, in the container. So it's not gonna work correctly. And so we had to send it back. But Amazon is easy to send back things. When we found it's out really Amazon cool. is so easy to send crap back, I'm like, let's send everything back. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty easy. You put it, submit your thing, you go to the UPS store, they scan a little code on your phone, and boop, it's gone. Bye-bye. All done. And you get another one the next day most of the time. Yeah, we're supposed to get the other one today, right? Today, yeah. And so. I told them what was wrong with it, you know, and... and uh, I even had a, a quick little picture that I took and yeah. uploaded to the wherever I bought it from on Amazon. Makes it easy. And they said, okay, you get another one coming to you because this one's already been scanned at the UPS store, so. Yep, so that's awesome. Um, oh, and then wives, don't buy your husband his socks because you'll get the wrong thing. Here we go. <laughs> so I sent you pictures from the grocery store because. You send me too many pictures and I'm looking at all <laughs> these. Too many choices. She's sending me pictures of socks from Walmart. <laughs> like, hey, which ones you want? Oh, never mind. So I just grabbed a pair. I'm and like, of course, they were the wrong thing. Why can't there just be one type of sock? Because <laughs> there isn't one type of person. So everybody... everybody would wear the same sock at that point, so it wouldn't matter. Then you could go buy me socks. <laughs> well, bought... now I know. <laughs> she bought the wrong socks. I bought socks. the wrong socks, so we had to take those back. So we did that. <laughs> we get home. We get home. We have lunch. And we come out here and we dig some trenches for the Hillary storm. Hillary hurricane. Y yes. It's just going to end up being a rainstorm. Yeah, but it should be, it's supposed to be a lot of rain. But and it's we actually where we are is in that goofy cone that they put on the screen on TV. It was funny. I was looking at the radar and I'm like, why is this all pink? Because it was like a pinkish, reddish pink. And when I expanded the picture, it was like, oh my God, we're in that hurricane cone. We're in the cone. So it's supposed to go we'll all see. the way up to Montana through Idaho into Montana. With heavy before, rains. Before winds. it dissipates completely. But so, uh, obviously not what people near the ocean get. But, no. But still some sustained yeah, we're, winds we're, and a lot of we're rain. We're going to get several inches of water. So we are preparing, digging the trenches again because yeah. if you remember when we 
kind of first got here in the spring in the spring we had some heavy rains that kind of flooded some areas so we're trying to prepare for that not to happen again so we did that and then we went and sat with Wendy outside for a little bit and we're talking and my phone rings and it's mom she wants to go to urgent care so if you remember last week and if you didn't watch please go back and watch it my mom had a little spill on her big old trike she was racing to chase the shuttle guy she and fell she fell over hit her head and was bleeding so ambulance Ugh. takes her to the hospital she gets treated for her head wound and her back was only hurting her a little tiny bit well the progression over the past week it has gotten worse the pain has gotten worse so she finally had had it wanted to go make sure nothing was really wrong so I went and took her to urgent care, and we waited and waited. They did x-rays, and we waited and waited. So, and really, on her birthday, she was with her mom in the hospital again. <laughs> Just like 60 years ago. <laughs> on her birthday. Mom had some back aches, and lo and behold, it's time to have a baby. So, <laughs> this time, the back ache was from her spill falling on the bike. But um, she's okay. And she kind of did, she got, got scolded by the nurse practitioner that she, because she took a leave, a leave is supposed to be a 12 hour pill, but it did nothing for her. So she took some Advil on top of the leave. So she got scolded for doing that. But she's but okay. She's okay. She's fine. She is, she wakes up hurting in the morning, but the more she moves around and takes some Advil, the better it feels. So, so when I came home, we went to dinner and we just... We had a plan to go out to dinner to this really fancy schmancy restaurant. <clears throat> no, we went to Border Town. <laughs> Border Town. <laughs> Border Town Casino. There's a little restaurant in there and we really like their food. What's it called? Cafana? Cafana? Cafana, something, something like that. Something like that, yeah. the restaurant. Yeah. So it was... Uh, it was we put up a couple of pictures on oh. uh, <laughs> our Facebook page last night because usually when we go out anywhere, doesn't matter where we go. The first thing she does so is look, clean silverware. I look at my silver and I'm like, <clears throat> so if it's really crusty, then it gets put on the side of the table for them to exchange it. If it's just water spots, I'll usually just wipe it off. But I always, I always get the dirty spot at the table <laughs> and the dirty silverware. It never fails. So last night we get there, got a clean table. My arms aren't sticking to the side of it. My silverware doesn't have any crusties or watermarks. It was like, yes! <laughs> so, what a birthday! <laughs> a birthday present, man. Have clean silverware and clean table. Oh, my god! So, and the food was really, really good as usual. You had something different. I had the lasagna because I love it. She but, always gets the same okay, thing. And here's another thing. You're going to think I'm just a pain in the ass when I go to a restaurant. Oh, God. Here because I always want something particular about my order. So I don't like a ton of sauce on anything. And so I asked for my lasagna without the extra sauce. The last time we got it, it's like they put it in this. It was like soup. Yeah, it was almost like a soup. And so I said, I asked the waitress, I said, I want the lasagna, no extra sauce. And I would like my garlic bread on a separate plate because they would put the garlic bread in the middle <laughs> of the it, sauce. And it'd come back soggy. And it'd be all soggy. <laughs> it came to me perfect, even with a little side of extra Parmesan cheese. Somebody up there told them it was her my birthday. birthday. They had to know because <laughs> my everything was clean. My order came out perfect. It was delicious. Yep. The only thing they didn't have birthday cake, so I had birthday pie. She had birthday <laughs> pie last night, but you had birthday. But then I had birthday cake later. Cake. Because when we got home. Wendy, Kevin, and our friends Courtney and Steve were all here, yeah. and Wendy had some little nothing bunt cakes. Have you ever had those? Oh my gosh. They are a chain, so there may be one where in your area. They are delicious. But they are so good. And she likes to get the little individual ones, because they're just better than like getting a big one. So we had nothing bunt cake for my birthday, and she got me a <laughs> couple presents. So I got these cute little Peridot earrings, which is my birthstone, our birthstone, hers and mine. So let me ask you and this. If what? there was only one earring, would it still be called a Peridot? Yeah. Or would it be called a single a dough? Nope. Peridot. But did you only get one? I know, but it's not a pair of. P-A-I-R. It's P-E-R-I-D-O-T. 
It's all in the spelling, dude. <laughs> so she got me that, and then she got me this little sprayer that I've been wanting that you put olive oil in this jar and it sprays the oil so that you know you, it's lighter for you, not as much oil. Because right now I have like a little squirt bottle thing, and uh, this way it sprays the olive oil. So it was wonderful. And then today we get to go and celebrate my birthday with family. Yes. With Another fun birthday day. Yeah. Yay. So it'll make up for yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> yesterday was fine. There was nothing <clears throat> bad about it. It was just kind of... Um, hey, the thing about being able to spend yesterday in the hospital with your mom is you remember yesterday's visit. I do. 60 I years ago, you don't remember it. I don't remember that. I just don't. I've only been told about it and, you know, read in my baby book about it, and that's that's it. Oh, my gosh. So, anyway, that was our eventful, non-eventful week. That's it. Tom's big, big thing on his list is every day he does his PT, mm -hmm. whether it be at home or at the physical therapist's. And uh, other than that, no other excitement. Nope. Thank goodness. So hopefully next week we'll have good news that we got our truck back all fixed. We'll see. Fingers crossed. Big for fingers us. crossed. Yep. And you all have a wonderful week. We'll see ya. Take your banner and raise it to the sky. Hey, here. you ready to go eat? She's pouting because we gave attention to her cousin. I gotta get up again. You ready to go in and eat? Huh? Okay. There, there. Let's go eat. You ready to go in the house? Let's go. Get in the house. Come on. Get in the house. Let's go. Let's go. She says, but Dad, you have to open the door. <laughs> First chef get oh nice shorts. Woo! Oh, look at those legs. Woo! Come on, get those are his working under the truck in the RV shorts.